All right. So let's look at the 70 dirhams that we just spent on food. All right. Before the changes, it used to be at 30%. So here we're looking at 21 dirhams. Now with the changes that were announced in February, it's different. Here we're looking at around 15%. If you want to be specific, we're looking at between 7% to 20%, depending on the size. So if it's 200 dirhams, it's 20%. If it's 50 dirhams, which is most of them, most of them are at this range is 7%. So that means here we're looking at anywhere from 5 to 14 dirhams. So it's a big saving. Now, what does this fee anyway constitute, whether before and after? It's a fee that covers it. Here, it covers the payment gateway. Even if the restaurant owner wants to go directly to their own bank to do this, they have to pay for the payment gateway. It covers the cost of the delivery. Here, the restaurant owner has to look at uh, the cost of the driver, healthcare, uh, maintenance of the motorcycles. Even if that's outsourced, that also needs to be factored in. Here, also, we're looking at uh, the cost of acquiring a customer. To get this uh, sale, they did not spend money on Facebook or Instagram or Google or TikTok. Kareem and Noon and, Deli and Deliveroo and Talabat, they have their own customers. So that covers the cost of acquiring those customers. And you have the technology itself. So the tech itself, you have the driver app, you have the customer app, you have the restaurant app, you have the cloud infrastructure, and also there's a the cost of the customer support. So that fee, which used to be 21 dirhams and then 14, covers payment gateway, delivery, uh, cost of acquisition, tech, and customer support. Before COVID, restaurants didn't care much about their online delivery. It was all supplemental, right? So it's an additional thing. Yes, there was a big 30% charge, but it was only a big deal for them because online delivery was a side thing. But after COVID, things have changed, right? So online delivery became the main thing. It's important for them that the 30% that, the that they pay be recovered. So that's why a lot more uh, companies came into the online delivery and uh, it was much more competitive than before. And of course, with the competition, prices are drive down. So now, instead of 30% that the restaurant owner pays, they pay 15, one, five. What does that mean for you as a consumer? Not much. You might get a discount here and there, but it's, it all goes straight to the restaurant owner. Now, the important part here is to understand that if restaurant owners wanted to do this themselves, they have huge costs. The technology infrastructure. Uh, which is they need an app for their driver, an app for the restaurant, an app for the users, and the cloud infrastructure. They also need to pay for customer service. They also need to pay for um, ads on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and others to acquire customers. Uh, a payment gateway. As a merchant, they need to pay a fee for that. So there's immense cost there. When they do this via a third party like Noon Food or Kareem or others, uh, this fee is paid in exchange for getting a customer, the technology, uh, customer service, and all of that. Sahteen.